Yo, what is up, bros? We are back here with a brand new update to the Great Patriotic War mod version 1.17. So, let me see here what is new. Fix the crashes that occurred while using units in 1962. Fix the unplayability of 1983. Huge scenario changes. Made all custom missions have their uh, separate campaigns rather than you needing to search for them. Separated the Soviet World War II campaigns from allies. Now all Soviet campaigns are located in World War II Europe allies. Merged all World War II Europe campaigns of the Western allies with World War II Pacific allies. All of them located on allies World War II Pacific. Added five new missions to the WTO campaign. Invasion of Yugoslavia, WTO-1. Battle of Singapore, WTO-6. Arabian War, WTO-7. And Red Storm, WTO-10. Oh, there's another one. Invasion of Australia, WTO-11. Added brutal hard mode missions for WTO-4, 5, and 13. Added a new conquest, Summer Blizzard. Alternate history scenario looking into what would have happened if Germany never invaded Russia. Uh, features a massive battlefield in Eastern Europe and the Battle of Midway. Added four new generals. So play any of the tutorials of Axis 1 Europe to unlock campaigns. If you already won them, you have to unlock them one by one. Yeah, I just, uh, since I played on Nox, I just basically had to reinstall it and then play the tutorial and then all the missions were unlocked. If uh, you, you already have played them and you've played the tutorial, then you go and yeah, they're not all unlocked and you kind of have to unlock them by playing the previous mission. Alright, so that was probably a little bit confusing just reading it off, so let me explain it a little bit better here. Um, all the Axis missions in Europe now are the brutal uh, custom missions. I believe they're all still on hard. I didn't even check that. Um, and then allies are now just the Soviet missions uh, that are brutal. And then all the missions that were here in Europe for the allies have now been moved to the allies uh, Pacific. So if you come over here, here they are. So that's where they've been moved to. All right, bros, let's check out these new missions. First up, we've got WTO Mission 1, Invasion of Yugoslavia. Oh shit, 20 rounds for the 3 star, but look who it is. We're going to have to deal with Tito and his 2,000 health. Alright, hold on a sec. Um, yeah, so that is our force. We do got a tier 3 dildo launcher. And this bro. But, we have got to take out every city. And of course Tito, but we do have Boris on our side. How much health you got? Four hundred. How are you going to do Boris like that? <sighs> Boris lives matter. And until we realize that, there's always going to be racism. We've got WTO Mission 6, Battle of Singapore. Twenty-two rounds for the three-star. Okay, yeah, but notice this bro's only a tier one, Yamashita. What you doing with your life? Yamashita lives matter. Damn, massive Kuala Lumpur circle jerk. Impressive. So, again, it looks like we've got to take all the cities docks and a crap ton of generals that might be a little time consuming I don't know if it's overly hard but yeah it's definitely gonna take some time we got WTO number seven Arabian war Soviets have Jerusalem 
26 rounds for the three star. Damn, check out Saudi Arabia's got an army. Not bad. Just wreck them, uh, block the coast, keep the British and French from landing, and should be able to complete this pretty good. So again, it looks like, yeah, all the cities again. We got WTO 10 Red Storm. Twenty rounds for the three star. Wow, that was cool. Uh, okay, we got the U.S. coming in from the north. Hold on again. You got Copenhagen taken by Bradley. Arnold's up there. Manstein with three thousand health. Montgomery, twenty-five hundred. Uh, this could be a slow start. Guderian. How are you going to give my man's Montgomery more health than my man's Guderian? Okay, again, every city docks, uh, well, a couple docks, and, or probably, probably, maybe just that general. So we got Invasion of Australia, WTO number 11. Twenty-six rounds. Oh, I haven't even been checking about how many generals you could use. Are they all about four? I'll have to recheck that. Four on this one at least. Okay. This is probably I'm gonna say the hardest one we've seen. Again, every city has to be taken. Our force is relatively small. Yeah, this is definitely going to be the hardest one, I think, out of the ones we've looked at so far. That's a lot of ground to cover. They've got a lot of units, a lot of high tier. And the best we can do is like a, a Vatutin and a Dildo Launcher. I'm going to assume without going all the way back through them that they're all going to be four because the Arabian War was also four, so... Moving on to the added Brutal Hard Mode missions. So first up we've got WTO Mission 4 on Hard. Six generals, 22 rounds for the three star. Hold on a sec. So we've got two cities. Level 2 industrial, level 3 industrial. Uh, I don't know, this doesn't look that hard. The Australian invasion one actually looked harder. Unless these guys just have a crazy amount of... Yeah, yeah it does have 4,000. Okay, I'm... Th I'm I'm seeing why this was hard now. These generals are got like max health hacks. Not this bro, but the other ones. How about you? You have max health? No. Yeah, I still don't think it'll be that hard. Next up we've got a WTO mission five on hard. Twenty-four rounds for the three star, six generals, and oh shit! I just played this one in the Throwback Thursday. Again, not not looking that hard, unless yeah, you don't have much health. Patton has three though. Thirty-six. Holy crap! 4,100? Yeah, definitely when you bring your generals in, make sure they got rumor on them. I usually roll with rumor, except sometimes I go like max, max damage 
I'll put like plane fighting on or something like that. Last mission, number 13 on hard. Twenty-six rounds for the three star six generals. Oh, this is a good one. This looks a lot like the Australian one. One sec. Yeah, we got some points up here we gotta capture. We've got two small forces, one coming in from the Midwest, one landing out of the Atlantic. Let's check health on this one. Oh shit, almost 5k on the Doom Turtle. Damn. And yeah, we, we got Rokoskovsky on a tier one. About tooting up on a tier four though, how much health do you got? Decent. All right, bros, is there anything else? Oh, shit, yeah, the new conquest, Summer Blizzard. Summer Blizzard. So what was it? Germany hadn't invaded the Soviet Union, although it does look like they went ahead and launched Operation Sea Lion instead of the Soviet invasion. So we got the major wars coming up on the Eastern Front, and we've got the Battle of Midway. Yeah, right here. Let's take a closer look at this. Yeah, that's a pretty major Soviet army, I'd say. Crap ton of Kartusha's butt. We've got the Soviet army kryptonite. We've got the Panzerwerfer 44s. And Levy boy. 600 health. Poor Lieb. War's not gonna end well for you, bro. So it looks like we got three of the generals are uh, Greek generals and the bro from the Discord. And then we also have this bro as a new general as well. Alright, bros, I think that is it. I probably missed something, but um, I will uh, instead of giving you the direct link to the mod download again I'm gonna link the uh, creators channel or actually his video and then you can read all the uh, update logs for this new version 1.17 so if you are enjoying this content you know what to do stop the like and subscribe hit the notification bell and I will see you back here for our next upload peace Bruminati out